judges. And uh, if you fancy hearing commentary tonight from Matthew Cutler on all of tonight's performances, then press your red button. Now, first up tonight is England cricketer Mark Ramprakash. <laughs> yes. How can those ladies? The ladies, the ladies. And, and his partner, Karen. Now, they'll be doing a waltz, but later on, Mark will be jiving to an Elvis Presley number. <laughs> oh, nice. that'll be a double bubble, yes. <laughs> Lots of wiggly hips. <laughs> There's nothing new in... Oh, sorry, I forgot about you lot. They're <laughs> so out of it. Not too much, dear. Don't, don't attack don't me. Don't leave them out. But, be it. but by the way, Mark, Mark, I've been doing this for years. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Can see. I was, Mark, I was doing this before you were born. <laughs> In fact, I was doing this before Elvis Presley was born. <laughs> anyway, here's their training. Last week, Mark's Foxtrot wasn't a hit with the judges. I was bitterly disappointed. This dance was not one of your best. It really wasn't flowing and I felt a bit tense and nervous and I got shot down in flames. And Karen also came under fire. What were you doing making something as difficult as that at this point? I'm just really a bit heartbroken. I do think I probably got it a bit wrong. No, you did. With the low marks in the foxtrot, I came very close to probably going out of the competition. Mark and Karen! <laughs> to get to the last four, it means a lot and I'm happy that I've got another week of dancing. Right. Oh. Okay, let's see if we can get a little bit more turn. This week, we've got the walls, and I'm out to prove that Mark can do ballroom. Superb. Awful. <laughs> I could make my choreography more simple, but I just know that Mark can do it, whatever I give him. Karen has started this routine with a pivot sequence. You do not remember <laughs> the trouble I had with these. I get really dizzy and get headache with it could have been the pivot altogether because I have had a lot of trouble with it. No. I think after last Saturday, I am very, very worried that I may have lost a little bit of Mark's trust. I'm just a bit worried. You know, if you go wrong in, in one bit, it could be very hard to drag it back. Oh, that was horrible. Just want him to believe in me as I believe in him. Yeah. Two, three. Very good. Karen's been very encouraging that I can do the ballroom. Brilliant. <laughs> OK, you got it. I've just got to follow her advice, relax the shoulders and the nerves to try and win a place in the semi-final. Dancing the Waltz. Will Mark Lamprecash and his dance partner Karen Hardy please take to the floor? This madness Lying safe within your arms I'm born again Comfort me through all this madness Woman, don't you know it you Oh, 
A beautiful dance to a beautiful song, OK? And the ballroom, I tell you. Yeah, well, we'll see. And, of course, we have our judges. Now, last week, Lynn joked about being married to Arlene. And Arlene... <laughs> no, Arlene, we've had thousands of letters, my darling, thousands of letters yeah. from men saying they'd love to marry you. Really. <laughs> on one, one condition. Yeah. Yeah, you don't hold up a score on the wedding. <laughs> That could be very off-putting. <laughs> I mean, just think about it, Arlene, you know. Don't, don't do it, dear. don't do it. Right, now, on to the nitty-gritty now. We're going to start off with Craig tonight on the end. What did you think? Well, what bounce-back ability you have. Yes. That was fantastic. Yes. <laughs> you proved that you can cope with the ballroom, and that's fantastic. A great amount of rise and fall. I thought it was absolutely great. You kept maintained your frame throughout. It was a genuine, honest and warm and sincere ballroom. Dogs. Wonderful. It was what great. A <laughs> well, I thought so at rehearsal. I looked at that, I thought, he's conquered the ballroom. But wait a minute, Arlene. Are you going to be picky or what are you going to do? No, the no. waltz is a dance of romance. Everything they did on that floor was romantic. It was beautiful. Well, I've got to agree how hard is he? Lynn, Lynn smiling. Yeah, well, uh, he's got a boyish grin like me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to mention your hair. <laughs> uh, but it was miles better than last week's Fox Trot. You had a wider hold, good movement round the floor. You missed a few of your heel leads. That was the only thing I could really find that I didn't like. It was a very, very good performance, and well done, Mark. Yes. Thank you. Oh, uh, well, really? Yes. You were, you were waltzing on a field of dreams. You were watching Prince Valiant returning to form. <laughs> you won it tonight. Yes. Keep going. Slightly over the top. <laughs> between... Me? Yeah. Never. No, but we, we, know, we know where you're at. Okay. Yes. I thought it was marvellous, and the ballroom, congratulations. Yeah. Okay, Thank and of course, it's all down to you. <laughs> Will they get a dreamy star for that dreamy waltz? Over to you, Tess. Thank you, Bruce. It was a dreamy waltz. It was beautiful. Now, the pair of you are not normal. Well, you are, but Mark, you're not as confident in the ballroom normally as the Latin. Do you feel after those glowing comments you might have cracked it? Oh, I've never cracked it, that's for sure, but I really enjoyed that. I managed to relax and, and the music was fantastic and it, it really helps when you've got a nice song. Yeah, the music was wonderful. And he worked so hard this week. He really put in... The, he's been saying, I've got to get this top line, I've got to get the top line. And for me, you know, he's just dedicated to it. You two have always it. trained the hardest throughout the competition. <laughs> Karen, might we see another cricketer in the final, perhaps? I hope so, because, I mean, they rock. Cricketers rock. <laughs> Tonight, let's what the scores are. The scores are in. Will the judges please reveal their scores? Craig Revel Horwood. Nine. <laughs> Arlene Phillips. Nine. Len Goodman. Nine. And Bruno Tognoli. to the show. Happy? Very, and it's all down to his dedication. Sports people, they're amazing, you know? They're amazing. To turn it around like that. So you did cross awesome. the ballroom. And of course you've got the Latin next. Yes, yeah. so looking forward to that. Really want to entertain with that, have some fun with it. It's going to be good. OK, well, we're looking forward to it. What do you think? Do they deserve to be back next week in our semi-final? If you think so, you've got the power. Pick up the phone and give them your vote. Bruce, back to you. All right.